It's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Libra. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for um, middle of June, okay? We're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for Libra for mid-June? What do we have for Libra? What do we have? soulmate soulmate so we have a soulmate connection here for libra now this is for libra sun moon rising and venus you may be reconnecting with a soulmate or there's somebody new coming into your life or you are uh with a soulmate now definitely a soulmate connection what do we have for libra for the middle of june Four of Coins, King of Coins reversed, Five of Wands reversed, the Chariot. So this is moving very fast. End of Conflict, maybe with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is obsessed. Somebody may have been obsessed with this person. You know, in reversed, there we have an individual who is only interested in money, sex, drugs, illegal dealings, this person does things illegally, isn't very stable, isn't very solid, isn't very loyal, unfaithful. Somebody's been holding on to this person, but this is the end of conflict. It's the end of playing tug of war. It's end of playing games, moving very quickly in a new direction. Now, I don't know if you're dealing with an earth sign. could be anybody. This is somebody who isn't interested and having anything stable okay they are only out for themselves this is holding on very stubborn okay obsessed moving in a new direction it's time for a change perhaps this is a card of transformation mastering your emotions uh changing directions finding the discipline not playing games anymore moving in a new direction yeah eight of cups reversed so this is pretending to be happy could be staying put refusing to move on we have a person that has been refusing to move on yeah maybe it's a soulmate connection but we have multiple soulmates in a lifetime so keep that in mind Something is definitely going on where somebody is waiting for an apology or they're staying put. They're holding on obsessively, okay? Now, somebody could be holding on to you. You could be holding on to them. This Five of Wands reversed is um, exhausted and fed up. So somebody is exhausted. They're sick. They're sick of playing games. There's probably some strong competition with this person. But this is getting in the driver's seat. This is taking back control. Controlling the, your emotions. Finding the self-discipline and the self-control. Taking a journey. Um, it's a transformation. This is emotional weakness. This is emotional strength. And this is emotional weakness. Interesting. So what do we have? Page of Wands. Oh, this is a new suitor. Some of you may have a new suitor that is better suited for you. Now, this person is probably a little bit younger. This person may be a little bit younger than your previous soulmate. Okay? But like I said, we have multiple soulmates in a lifetime. Now, this is receiving an invite to go for a ride, perhaps. Somebody may want to take you for a ride, take you someplace. <clears throat> this could be a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius doesn't have to be, but I think there's a little bit of an age difference. This person is exciting. They are probably attracted to you or you're attracted to them. It's, it's, an, it's, an, it's an attractive invite or offer this is good news a message message is coming from this person this person is adventurous they may have a lot of um uh they're feisty this person is very feisty um we have a very 
I think we have a very strong woman that is uh, moving towards this person. Okay, moving towards this person that is definitely, there's an age difference. Six of Wands. Now, this is a yes. This is, this. the fight is over. It's like the battle is over. The struggle is over. This could be like your, your savior or hero. This is somebody that is noble and uh, will do anything to prove themselves. So we do have an individual that is, not wanting to play games that is probably going to be giving you some sort of invite or an offer. This is an opportunity for you to move in a new direction. Okay, so just pay, pay, pay attention to that. I think this some, I don't know whoever this part is for, but somebody that is watching this is obsessed with holding on to an individual who uh, isn't interested. Okay, this person isn't interested. They're not. This person is only interested in all that they can obtain financially. And they've been playing games with you or whatever the case is. They've been playing games. They've been dealing with competition. But we do have an individual that is moving in a new direction because it is a new suitor. Somebody that is very well suited for them. Now, fire goes very good with air. So this is definitely somebody that is very... A very good match, perhaps. This is a new discovery. This is definitely traveling in a new direction um, towards victory, okay? Where you don't have to play games, where you don't have to fight constantly and deal with competition, okay? The Six of Wands is, an, is uh, you know, there's nothing, to, there's nothing to prove here, okay? Now, this person, this is a yes. This is a win. Uh, this person is very noble and highly respected. Okay, they are recognized for the person. They have a good character. Okay, this person has a very good character. Um, fearless, fearless. Um, and they're not going to give up. This is somebody who is very brave, very brave individual who um, will prove themselves to you. So there is definitely an individual here that is willing to do whatever it takes to win, to win your heart, perhaps. Now, this Ten of Wands, this is overwhelmed, still hanging on to a burden, hanging on to baggage. This person, this is proving themselves. You got a person that's going to prove themselves to you, okay? They are. Nine of Wands reversed. So there's some sort of personal fear here. I don't trust. I don't trust too wounded. Somebody has been very wounded by this individual. So to the, so much that they don't trust. They don't trust that whoever this new discovery is or this new interest is, they don't trust this person. It's like you don't trust that this person is being genuine. But this person is noble. So you can trust them. I think your previous wounds from this person that wasn't loyal, that was jealous, that was unfaithful, that wasn't really interested in something stable. I think those wounds, you know, you need to let go. You need to stop holding on to that burden. You need to stop holding on to that baggage. Let go, Try your best to stop uh, going back and forth and, and with those, okay? Because these are wounds. This is somebody who has been extremely wounded here. And is um, refusing to compromise, refusing to let go. So you really need to let go of that baggage that you have been holding on to so much. Okay, this is, you know, obsessed. Obsessed. Um, and whether it's you or the other person, somebody is obsessed with holding on. And it's overwhelming. It's been overwhelming. This is acceptance. This is the truth. This is having the power. This is seeing the truth. This is an awakening. It's a wake-up call. Seeing the truth about who hurt you. You may be coming to some sort of terms with whoever hurt you. You know, you're starting to see the truth. You're starting to wake up. This is moving. 
Ah, I don't know if you're dealing with a Leo. You could be. doesn't have to be. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But this is not happy. A lack of growth. A lack of clarity. And this is clarity. So we. this is finding the discipline and the mental strength to master your emotions and move in a new direction. Even though you're not happy about it and you're still holding on to the burdens. You know, you may have been, you know... Trying to prove yourself to somebody else. I don't know. Now this is the truth. Accepting the truth. Seeing the truth. You could be dealing with somebody. This guy that has a chip on their shoulder. Man or woman. This person has a chip on their shoulder. They um, want their own way. No matter what. They are unwilling to compromise with you. It's somebody that is very disagreeable. Somebody that has extreme pride. And this is seeing it. So I think that you're starting to see that you're dealing with some, or that you were obsessed with holding on to somebody. This person is a miser. They're only looking for stability, money, gifts, things. Okay? They're looking to for what they can get from another person. Not love. Okay? <laughs> not love. So this person over here is very superficial okay um shallow and this is seeing the truth that there's no growth there's no happiness here this is unrealistic somebody this is unrealistic the sun reverse is unrealistic So there's been a lot of sadness and it's been really unhealthy. There's been some, this is unhealthy baggage, unhealthy burdens that somebody has been holding on to. This is accepting. Ah, these are both power. This is power and this is power. Taking your power back and this is too. Taking back control of your life. Taking back control of an unhealthy situation that has held you down for too long. You are finding those resources to shed the old, to bring in the new. You have a new soulmate here. A reconnection with somebody. And, and I think that our soulmates are destined to before we are born. And I do, I, you know, maybe this person was a soulmate at one time. But this is somebody new. So this is somebody new. You have manifested a new opportunity after holding on to something unrealistically, okay, or vice versa. Um, this is this is um, headed towards victory, receiving some good news, receiving an offer or an invite from somebody that you may have rejected in the past. Maybe you rejected them because you were holding on to this person. Vice versa, this can go. Somebody was rejected, now they're coming back around. There's like a second chance, perhaps. This is not with the person that you have been obsessed with. Okay, somebody else, I know that it is. This is taking action, being in charge, becoming self-aware. Seeing clearly. This is definitely seeing clearly. So you are definitely seeing clearly that you have been holding on to something that is unrealistic. Whether it's you or the other person. So I think we have some letting go here. Starting something new. There's been an unfairness. There's been an injustice. Not happy with the outcome. Not happy. We have somebody here that has something you didn't turn in your favor. Didn't turn out in your favor. And it's been a level of sadness. I think there's been a lot of sadness here. This isn't fair, you know. And holding on to this unfair situation. Not realizing that, you know, everything happens for a reason. It does. I feel like you have this newfound clarity um, that gives you the power to take control of this unhealthy situation. It's like you're taking back your power. You're taking back your control. You're controlling your emotions. You're mastering your emotions. And you're moving forward now. You're moving forward. Ah, could have something to do with a father. I'm not sure if this has to do with a father or a husband or an alpha. 
This could be an alpha male. Could be have to do with a boss. This is a masculine energy. This is, and we could even have a masculine. We do have a masculine that is taking it. This is the magician is a very masculine energy. Communication, movement. So we have somebody that is moving in a new direction, very very fast. This person has made a decision to take. They know exactly what they need to do. This person is very decisive. He has made up his mind. So we have a masculine that has made up his mind. He is not happy at all. This is an injustice. This isn't fair. This is this is um, something not... There, there, there may have been an argument with, with no resolution in sight where somebody decides to just move. Because this could be moving. Somebody just... I'm, I'm out of here. So that, that no, not every part of this reading will resonate with you. Take what does and leave the rest. Somebody is choosing to move because they have been treated unfairly. There's been some sort of lies. There's been some sort of deception. They've been weighed down. It's too much. There's illness here as well. There's some sort of illness. You know, the stress, extremely stressed. So some this this masculine is taking action to move in a new direction away from an unhealthy situation. He is headed towards something victory done fighting. Absolutely done. Not fighting anymore. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Um so you're gonna be receiving some news. You are going to be receiving a message or some news. That directly affects you from a masculine energy. This person has decided. The decision has been made. This person has decided. They don't, they don't care if you like the outcome. They don't care if it's fair to you. You may not think it's fair. But they have made the decision. The decision has been made to move on. So you may not like it, but the masculine has, and the masculine has made the decision to move on. And you don't have to like me for saying that. And that's kind of like how he's coming across. You don't have to like it. The decision has been made. Now, this, this is lack of spiritual growth, the Eight of Cups reversed. This is pretending to be happy. Somebody has been pretending to be happy. But now they have no more fear. And they've probably lacked some courage. But now they're finding their strength with both of these cards in this card to stop fighting, stop playing these games, and just go. Okay? So this is some sort of public recognition. So there's going to be some public rec recognition here. Maybe it's for a father or a husband. But the public recognition is for the masculine. Just so you know, um, if that's the case, this person um, is very much highly respected. And I think they just can't take it anymore. Somebody can't take it anymore. They can't. They can't take it anymore. Now, if you are the feminine watching this, you, you may be headed towards a masculine. This is an alpha male. This is an alpha male. This is somebody that will protect you and take care of you. This is a protector. You may be moving in with this person. This guy will protect you at all costs. This is a new discovery. Somebody is taking action to move in a new direction. And it is going to lead them towards victory and success. This is like a savior or a hero. And I think it's unexpected. This is lack of foresight. There we have a relationship that hasn't been on the same page. Somebody has been pretending to be happy. Or they've been pretending that it's going to get better. And they've been obsessed with holding on. But now it's time to relax and let go of fear. It's time to take control and head on out. So I think, and, there's, and, then, and then we also, on another scenario, somebody is headed towards a, a masculine that is going to protect them and uh, give it their all. Okay, this person is a, 
strong, strong, strong individual that will not desert you like this person did. Good luck.